loving your students unconditionally, accepting them with their limitations, with their uh, abilities, can help in inculcating a sense of industry. Make them the captains of their destinies. Inculcate that they have a potential and they can do it. Uh, we should encourage students that focus on learning and develop a mastery approach. Mastery approach is, is when they are driven intrinsically to learn. I'm Professor Dr. Sayeda Salma Hassan, currently working as a chairperson of the Department of Psychology and uh, I'm a teacher by choice. In 1997, I joined Government College. I have the honor to serve this department twice as a chair. So my areas of expertise are educational psychology, social psychology, developmental psychology, and forensic psychology. I have won HEC Best University Teacher Award. I believe what else a teacher can desire other than to be acknowledged at national level for her hard work and for teaching practices. It boosts your self-esteem, it motivates you. My teaching philosophy is to create a conducive uh, learning environment for the students where they can question, they can explore, they can investigate, and they can reflect on a learning. I think that at undergraduate level, a teaching-centered approach which involves lecture methods, and I feel that this is a very effective method to uh, introduce new concepts, to uh, help the students at undergraduate level to form uh, foundational concepts and to enhance their conceptual learning. Lecture method is uh, interesting. Banana. At second level, I use student-centered approaches. In student-centered approach, I always encourage my students uh, that do not accept the Western theories as it is. Do not agree with the assumptions of the Western theories. Sometimes there is a need to develop our own theories because these are not applicable to Pakistani cultural student-centered approach which is more transactional. Uh, help them to have hands-on experience and practical experience whereas teacher-centered approach is very important in imparting and making imparting knowledge and making them understand uh, the theoretical concepts. Uh, coming to the what tips I can give to their to my young colleagues Remember the names of the of your students. Call them uh, with their names because this will strengthen the beautiful bond that exists between the teacher and the student. We cannot make our students critical thinkers until and unless we encourage them to write in their own words and to share their own personal perspective. Uh, one of our great teacher said uh, once that teachers are made, they are not born. Teaching is a very difficult profession. It demands extraordinary hard work. Ab jitna usme invest karenge, jitni mehnat karenge, utna hi usi tarah communicate kar paenge. Um, I have 45 uh, research publications, and uh, these are published in the national and uh, international uh, reputable uh, journals. I intend to do postdoctorate um, uh, from. Uh, uh, any prestigious university in the area of uh, educational psychology. I want to um, establish uh, linkages, linkage of the Department of uh, Psychology with, uh, with reputable foreign universities. My goal is to make such linkages and I will get the opportunity to get out of its exposure. I think that this is how we can compete with international uh, standards of teaching and research. I would like to mention few names who have uh, played a significant role um, in my professional and personal development. Professor Dr. Anik Ahmed, my mentor, Professor Dr. Asir Ajmal, Ms. Najmud Sahir Andarabi, who taught me at Intermediate uh, Psychology, Madam Shiri Asad, and Professor Dr. Ruhi Khaled. When we say that teachers make nations, uh, I think uh, the teachers need to inculcate a sense of humanity in students. And when we are able to produce competent, conscientious uh, 
people in different uh, uh, fields of specialization, then they are able to serve their country to the best of their capability.